My channel this is Sue for me and my snails and beauty whittle um excuse me sorry for the um, all the banging and clattering in the background right I am back again to show you these lovely five so today we've got dusty dusky rose we have wilderness carbon cola and espresso so like I've started doing in other videos I'm gonna go and pop one and then come back and show you the the second pop and hopefully then these videos will get shorter in time and be maybe maybe just a little bit more professional um, <laughs> or quicker for you guys to watch anyway so be back in a tick and as if by magic, voila, we have all five. So, let me see if I can get this centered here now. Um, right, this first one is Dusty Rose. No, Dusky, Dusky Rose. And then we have Wilderness. Then we have Cola. This one is Espresso, and then this last one is the Carbon. So that's them with their first pop. Right now, let's see if we bring it in closer. Do to get prettier. Turn the red way. Don't know. Anyway, I'm going to stop messing. All right, so I'm going to pop the second coats on them. Um, oh. Dear Lord, what have I just done? No, um, carbon's last. See, as soon as I try and do anything clever, no. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave them on the pops. But I'm going to bring this up to the camera. So hopefully this will be able to catch that colour beautifully. You see how gorgeous that colour is. It's beautiful isn't it this is dusky rose um, not really what I was expecting from a rose color I was expecting more ready you know that sort of along those but dusky rose is what it's called so that's its second coat and then we're going on with wilderness so this is wilderness in its beautiful form. Bring it up. There you go. Look at that. Looks like a little, little weird chocolate colour. I'm just going to keep them on there. You watch, I'll drop them all now because I did before. But anyway, right, so I hope this video finds you well and fine. Um, this is now, we're still we're still in July, um, and I'm actually still July the 13th, so it's still gorgeous here, so I hope it's gorgeous wherever you are. Anyway, so we're going to go on with a cola, because I don't want to make these videos exceptionally long, because they are only pops, um, and it is only for you to see the colour itself. Right, now, where have I gone? Where have you gone? Hello, where am I? Where am I? There I am. Right, oh, jeez. See, I give myself a new layout and balls it up. So, cola. Cola's a nice brown. It's definitely not like Coca-Cola colour at all. So, these are in their brown collections. <laughs> go away, go away, Fuzzy. These will be within 
the, the browns collections of um of the jelly feet brand you could actually get away with this dusky rose as a nude on certain clients depending on their skin tone right so now we're going in with espresso so this is espresso look how gorgeous that is <sighs> quick listen oh it's beautiful isn't it so this is a dark brown as you can see from the pot so second coat and these are only thin coats It looks like I've put a lot on when it's on camera. Believe me, it's it's not. And people who use Jelly Freak actually know how far these things go. So you don't need a lot because the opaqueness in the colour is a wonderful. So charcoal. So charcoal, I'm presuming, without even looking at the size, is going to be within the black greys. Now, that was not what I was expecting from Charcoal, considering I have some of their black rays, you know, along with the Manhattan, the Sky um, yeah, the Sky High and all of them. I've got, um, which one was this? This is Carbon. I've got Charcoal in that one. Um, so I was expecting Carbon to be a different, more along the black than the well it is a grey black but more blacker than this so let's pop these in now if you're new to jelly feek oh there they go big bang if you're new to jelly feek hello welcome if you're new to my challenge challenge the channel hello welcome thank you for joining us please hit that like subscribe and the bell button and once I've got to 50 of you guys following me I have a gel polish giveaway because I've ordered these now for a little while and obviously I get really 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 excited when I see the colors and I'm like oh god I have them and I just click 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 away and then when they get here I get duplicates so I have got a few now that are sat over there so anyway this is the armor top coat which you all know i use um so anyway getting back to it so once i've hit 50 subscribers um i put a little bit too much on there so i've just spread it onto the other tip oh you want to go um you don't need a lot of this anyway get back to it so stop faffing right when I get up to 50 subscribers, then what I'm going to do is do a giveaway of the gels that I have as my copies. But unfortunately, you have to be in the UK. So I'm just going to randomly pick one of the 50. It's not going to be the 50th person. It's not going to be the first person. It's not going to be anything like that. It's just going to be random in there. Right, so anyone who's new to the channel and new to the Jelly Feek brand, let me just give you a little bit of a... Ugh. Right, Jelly Feek um, is a vegan, HEMA-free brand. Um, now, HEMA or HEMA, however you want to pronounce it, is the allergen that we develop. Well, it's the allergy we develop that's in the monomers and in the oh they're crazy anyway if you're not used to my channel this is this is this is like seriously just like normal everything goes boobies up and i don't think i've got another little sticky pad that's sticky no no stickies oh right anyway um I'm not usually this bad. I'm faffing over the bloody top coat. They only go they only go in a box. Right. Anyway, so Jelly Feek is a brand that is from the UK. It's up in Edinburgh. And as I said, it is HEMA and vegan. So as we know the government brought in, I think it was in 2021 or legislation. Sorry, didn't mean to knock you then. 
um, of everything nail wise had to be HEMA free. I jumped on this lot because I developed an allergy to HEMA. So the collection I had couldn't be used anymore on myself. So during lockdown, found Jelly Feet. Absolutely amazing company, but that's just my take. So anyway, you've got top coats, base coats, rubber base coats, and then you've got top coats with um, a range of flakies and colors and unicorns and all of that that have just come out. And you've also got the um, gel foil. Now, these all ones all come, these all cure in a UV lamp and an LED lamp. If it's in an LED lamp, it is 60 seconds. And if it's in a UV lamp, it is 120 seconds. So make sure you know what lamp you've got, right? And then all your gels cure in 30 seconds or obviously 60 seconds if it's in a UV lamp. Um, Oh God, that one looks blooming awful. It'll do for just this second, it'll do. Um, so when when you come in to cure them and say you find it's just not cured and properly check your lamps, the, the bulbs only do last for so long. So anyway, as I say, if you're new to my channel, oh, welcome, hit all them buttons. Yes, I am absolutely crazy. I'm barking mad. Nothing ever goes right. It always goes wrong. So come along for the laugh. And I'm still trying to make these videos shorter. Um, I have stopped now trying to describe these colours because jellyfish just make it too bloody hard. I can't describe them. So, right, what I'm going to do with this one is I'm just going to buff it. And then I'm going to top coat it again and I'll come back and I'll show you them. So don't hold your breath because I'll be straight back. Anyway, they're all done. So these are the colours. So we have from here, Dusky Rose. The next one is Wilderness. Then we have a Cola in the middle. Espresso and carbon. So I've just I've just done them, and as what normally happens is I look around my desk and I think, right, what's next? And I just saw that I had two two little ones sat on the side. Right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna bring these two in. So let me go and start these, and they can stay in this video. Give me a mo. Right, the reason I've brought these in is I don't actually know if I've done these on another video. So if I have, you're getting doubled up. So this one is almond oil. It's absolutely gorgeous on. And this one is hibiscus. And that is another lovely one on. So this is the first coat of almond oil. Let me just tap the screen. Has that got it? Has that got it? Right, almond oil is absolutely beautiful. And you can get away with using that with a little bit of base coat just to take it down a bit to make your milk bath nails. And hibiscus just speaks for itself. Gorgeous pink. So that's the first coats. And these are on unprepped nails as I always do. All right, so I'm gonna bring the colors up so you can see them, see if the camera wants to behave. look at that can you see that is it behaving let's have a look it's not behaving now oh my dear lord oh stop but it's not like it's got a thousand or one sparkles in it it hasn't so this is your almond oil and it's a lovely cream absolutely gorgeous little cream so Beautiful for bases if you're going to be doing nail art and you want the nail art to pop out or do the nail art in this. 
but it's absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I must admit, I've worn almond oil a couple of times now as a colour and as nail art. So let's see what we can do. If I'm not going to touch the camera, I'm going to do it slowly. There's hibiscus. Isn't that just a lush pink? Right, so as you know, with Jelly Feek, I've got over 300 colours now. So you're going to get pinks that are very, very close to one another. I'm lucky enough where I've just taken receipt now. I'll get out. I always get a fuzzy. Um, I've just taken receipt of... Um, another parcel which has 60 plus colours in it that for now up until today's days is the full collection from Jelly Feek so I will be bringing all them to you as time goes by so these will get the armour top coat and I will see you no I won't you will see all the pictures at the end of this so thank you for joining i hope that this video in is a little bit better it doesn't take too much of your time up and that you get enough information from it so once again they're the original ones that we started with so i can just get them in and i'll pop the names um in the bio as well and then there is your almond oil and your hibiscus so I will see you in the next video. Thank you for joining me. Take care, love and peace to everybody.